the El Palmar community of fishermen. Fishing has long been one of the most important economic activities in the Albufera. The different kings who owned the lake gradually came to regulate this activity. In 1250, James I granted permission to fish on the lake in his privilege of Morella to any resident or inhabitant of the city or kingdom of Valencia in exchange for one-fifth of the fish caught. This portion was handed over to the monarch and the fishermen kept the remaining four parts. The exact origins of the El Palmar community of fishermen are unknown. In 1857, their deed of establishment was officially signed. The community of El Palmar was thus granted a reduction in the fishing fee by the Royal Treasury from one-fifth down to one-tenth of the catch. The community of El Palmar is governed by a committee that meets every year with three commissions and on various dates. The chapter commission meeting, held on the first Sunday in July, is in charge of reviewing or modifying the regulations and electing offices. The following Sunday, the Red Orleans Commission meeting deals with the most important activity, raffling off the fishing permits for the Albufera, known as Red Orleans. The next Sunday, the Accounting Commission meets. Membership in the Brotherhood of El Palmar is an inherited right passed on to men when they reach the age of 24 or before that if they get married. The right to hold a Red Ali, which is a fishing permit, can also be transferred by donation or sale. However, only relatives can substitute the buyer or donor. At present, the community of El Palmar has approximately 400 members and about 100 of them remain active. They continue to devote themselves to the traditional fishing of eels and the flathead mullet. At their fish market, they sell the mullets fished each day using traditional methods and eels from fish farms or caught on the lake.